what you all been waiting for, ain't it? Ain't it? What's up guys, Krugs here, and I'm bringing you a bronze French squad builder for today, and I'm going to go through the players real quick, and then there's some pretty nice goals at the end. So starting off with the striker, we have Benzia, and he costs about twenty to 25000 and the main reason for that is because he's 4-star skills, and his stats are actually pretty good. He has 78 pace and 77 dribbling. Uh, the center forward, Deidola, he's also 4-star skill moves, and then moving on to all the midfielders, they're all 3-star skills. And then for the right mid, getting to him in a second, this is the informed version of him. The non-informed version is also 64 overall. Uh, so I want to do a little comparison of his in-game stats. Right here is the non-informed version, and then in a second it's going to get to the informed version of his uh, in-game stats. And a couple uh, stats on his card or his, uh, his in-game stats to take note of. His finishing goes from 69 to 80. His long shots go from 61 to 71. His pace goes up a little bit, and then his shot power goes from 63 to 73. Um, 73 shot power, you may not think um, that's so good, but for a bronze player against bronze goalkeepers, that's actually really good. And I definitely did notice a difference in his play. Uh, for the defenders, I basically just picked up the paciest guys I could get. And when I was playing like bronze English squads, I did find that these guys were able to defend strikers like Slu and Sinclair. So this squad is maybe the best squad to match up against bronze English squads because they're just so overpowered. But getting into the goals right now, um, this first goal is with Benzia. Rainbow over the keeper was actually uh, pretty nice. I've done that quite a bit on FIFA 13. Um, another thing, I'm playing a 4-4-1-1 formation. And that's the same formation that I played with my bronze English squad. And I don't know, I really like playing it. I like the fact that there's a striker and a center forward. How one plays up a little bit, one plays back a little bit. Um, I think it fits my style of play. If you guys haven't tried a 4-4-1-1, um, definitely try it out. I'd say it's one of the best formations in the game. That's actually a really nice free kick from Benzia. Um, I believe that was 37 yards. His free kick stats really aren't too amazing. But I did make another free kick with him, which was close range. Uh, I didn't show it in the video because it was so close. But um, definitely some decent free kicks from Benzia. Um, what else? Uh, people do ask what the total cost of my squads are. And this one, I mentioned Benzia being about twenty to 25000 And then the rest of the squad, really not too expensive. I think the center backs cost me one or 2000 so overall, the squad is going to cost between thirty and thirty-five thousand. If you don't have the inform right mid, if you do have the inform version of him, he costs about seventy to seventy-five thousand. So that's going to be about a hundred to a hundred and ten thousand uh, with the inform. Uh, another thing, Court right here, he's sixty overall center mid, but I did notice he was he played much better than a sixty overall, and he's not rare. And I know there's some other center mids that probably have a higher rating. But the main reason I did pick up Court is because he does have three-star skills. And not too many French center mids that have three-star skills. So uh, that's really the main reason for him. Um, this video is coming close to an end. Uh, nice goal there from Baby off the keeper's face. Uh, this last goal right here, this is our custom set piece. We call it the dart. Um, I made a video um, about two, three weeks ago explaining this. So if you guys want to check that out. Um, here's a little preview of it. You guys can click the link on the screen and hopefully you guys enjoy that video. I'll talk to you guys later.